Later on the Joy Business Van, we conclude our series on Andancy Travels, which is making 10 years in business. We explore how the travel agency is diversifying its operations. These are more shortly. Grateful for your company, I am Pio Skujubaka. Straight up, the government statistician Professor Samuel Kobnendim has called on policymakers to take a critical look at factors contributing to the increase of food inflation. He pointed out that food inflation has consistently seen an increase with about 20 percentage points compared to non-food inflation. Speaking to journalists after announcing the inflation rate for June 2023, which increased marginally to 42.5 percent compared to 42.2 percent in May 2023, Professor Inim announced that prices of common staple food such as vegetables and fish continue to record an increase over the period. So at the minimum, we need to focus on why we see food inflation um, going up relative to non-food inflation. As we indicated, we have seen about a 20 percentage point change between food and non-food inflation, which is higher than the gaps that we saw um, in the previous month. In terms of the items that make up the top 20 upward changes, it is always important to emphasize not just the price changes, but the price changes in relation to the weights. This is very important because if we want to drive down inflation, what matters is the items that have the highest weight. And clearly, among the top 20 items, we see fish, either a smoked or a fresh fish. These are items that have weight of about 2.9 and 1.8 in our basket. And they are recording changes in excess of 80%. So clearly, if we want to drive down inflation at the item level, this should be the focus. Mr. Samuel Kobnen him there. Now, the Bank of Ghana has assured savings and loans companies across the country of putting up measures to address issues of non-performing loans and high interest. According to the central bank, it has observed the challenge facing players in the sector. Speaking on behalf of the governor, head of banking supervision at the Bank of Ghana, CIGC, urged members of the sector to comply with regulatory standards as the central banks continue with its effort in ensuring financial stability. He spoke at the 13th annual general meeting of the Ghana Association of Savings and Loans Companies. The Bank of Ghana has observed with concern some increases in non-performing loans, NPLs, and increases in funding costs, which may sooner than later threaten the safety and stability of the soft sector. It is imperative that prompt corrective actions are put in place, curb the rising trends in NPLs, and also diversify funding sources to enhance profitability and foster customer confidence. Saeed is the head of banking supervision at the Bank of Ghana. Now, the Ghana Real Estate um, Developers Association Grader has bemoaned the over-reliance on imported building materials, cautioning that it is negatively affecting players in the industry. According to Executive Director Samuel Amegaibo, governments should make conscious efforts to cushion local companies in the country. He urged government to expedite the processes for passing the condominium bill to help regulate activities within the housing sector. We are over-relying on importation. Can we do something to you know, increase our local production for the input for building? Averagely, one house will need about six to seven WCs, a typical three-bedroom or so. We need about five WCs in a typical house. How many industries do we have in this country that produces uh, WC? We don't have. So everything is what? Importation, importation, importation. So we need to help our local industries to produce what we need so that we can cut down on over importation to help us because the dollar volatility issue. Samuel Amegaibo is the executive director for the Ghana Real Estate Developers Association Grida. And that's it for the Joy Business Report. Please stay tuned in for the Joy Business Van after this break. Cargo handling can be so tiring. Eh? Having to shuffle between banks to make payments. And waiting hours for payment confirmation. And worst of all, incurring avoidable costs due to payment delays. Charlie! But with EcoBank, making cargo payments has become super convenient through their digital self service and in branch channels. Sell smoothly with EcoBank and experience our one stop payment solutions for all your cargo related payments. Pay your customs duties and all levies, terminal handling, and shipping line fees. And enjoy smart financing solutions to support your cargo handling operations. Contact us on 0800 003 225 or walk into the nearest EcoBank branch to find out more. Echo Bank, the Pan African Bank. Hello, welcome.
welcome to the Joy Business Bank. It is brought to you by EcoBank, the Pan African Bank, and MTN Business. What are we doing today? Government is on a quest to boost its tourism earnings. The tourism sector projects $3.4 billion as revenue this year, setting a target of $1.2 million for inbound visitors. Travel and tour operators are critical in meeting this target. In our final episode, tracking the 10-year journey of Adansi Travels, we learn how the travel agency is diversifying its operations to meet the country's tourism needs. Here's a Joy Business Fund episode for today. Hi, good evening. Thank you for calling Adansi Travels. Louisa speaking. How can I help you? The offices of Adansi Travels are busy. The team is preparing a 10th anniversary tour. And, uh, it covers your return flights, your uh, accommodation, your um, visa support, breakfast, dinner. It's been quite a journey for Adansi Travels, Epifans. founded by businessman Gideon Asari. To mark 10 years in business, recipient of the Ghana Tourism Authority's Best Stories Operator Award, has chartered a flight to Dubai. If Gideon and his team are able to pull this off, it will go down in history as one of Adansi Travels' biggest achievements. Alansi Travels has blazed a trail in promoting packet tours and reignited the passion of Ghanaians to travel. Gideon considers this the most impactful thing. Let's say even 5,000 people have traveled with me. And all these 5,000 people wouldn't have probably traveled at all. You understand? So the main impact is bringing that, that vibe, that, that drive in people to to travel and making people feel that uh, travel is easy. Now, Adansi Travels is diversifying its operations to protect its business from challenges experienced during the COVID-19 pandemic. We've added essential travels like health, like we've also added work. If we want to go and, go and travel and work and study and stuff like that. So um, we've, we've created a number of subsidiaries, um, about about five of them, that will be launched this year. That will help concentrate their effort on aspects of the business that are not directly or uh, that are not um, linked with the, the the main focus of the travel. So. We have the Boss Travel Club that will take care of the lifestyle of our clients. We have the Adansi Health Tourism that take care of those who want to travel and get some treatments. We have the um, Adansi Properties that's taking care of those who are interested in um, investing in properties outside the country and inside. Those who want second passports to travel um, we have a unit for that. We have the Adansi Edu Consult that is taking care of education. So the main fo- the direction is to grow these subsidiaries so that by a few years to come, all of them will be on their own. Adansi Travels is also on the quest to promote Ghana as the number one travel destination in Africa. We also have plans to open in the U.S. so that it will be our inbound wing. So once you open the US, you could do more marketing to get more people to to come to Ghana. So that's where we are going. Gideon hopes this would encourage other travel operators and bolster Ghana's earnings from tourism. Adansi Travels aims to become a global business that would require more funding and securing the right skill set that is lacking. There are no much institutions that train um, tourism staff, especially when it comes to tour packages, the thing that we do, tour operations, when the deep things, uh-huh, at a certain level of the business, you need to be super professional. So you can carry the same mindset to that, but we don't have um, much training institutions that you can take the people through to reach there. It's very tough. Gideon describes Adansi Travel's 10-year journey as humbling. He's happy to have provided jobs for many 
and fulfilled to have shared in the happy moments of his clients as they traveled the world. You can catch the Joy Business Fun at 5 p.m. on Business Live on the Joy News channel later today. Let's take some messages from Echo Bank. Does your existing salary account give you more? Is your salary in the right account? Worry no more. The Echo Bank salary account is here to help you. Open an Echo Bank salary account today and enjoy free life insurance, which covers temporary and permanent total disability, critical illness, hospitalization, retrenchment, and death. With the Ecobank salary account, you have the ability to save as you spend, free debit card, access to loans and more. The best part is that you stand the chance to double your salary in the Ecobank Double Salary Promo Reloaded from now till end of July. So open an Ecobank salary account today by visiting an Ecobank branch or ecobank.com to open an account online for amazing benefits. Please beware of scammers who may contact you on this offer. Always visit any Ecobank branch or call Ecobank to free on 0800 003 for further details on the Ecobank salary account and the Ecobank double salary promotion reloaded. Terms and conditions apply. Ecobank, the Pan-African Bank. I am Pius Kuju Baka. Grateful serving you. Ignition is next. Do enjoy. Account who? Ah, why are you running? It's all about the Ecobank salary account. Ecobank salary account. Why? You're gonna make me fly. I promise it will make your pockets rise. The salary account comes with many incredible benefits like free life insurance, which covers permanent total disability, critical illness, hospitalization, temporal disability, retrenchment, and death. Also, save while you spend, access loans, get free debit cards, and the chance to double your salary and more in the Ecobank double salary promo reloaded. It's starting from this May to July 31st, 2023. And there are so many other consolation prizes to be won. Hey, no wonder my hand was itching. This is the perfect account for my salary. So go ahead, open an Ecobank salary account today. You also stand a chance to win more than double your salary from 1st of May to the 31st of July in the Ecobank Double Salary Promo Reloaded. Terms and conditions apply. This promo is under the supervision of the National Lottery Authority under the Caritas Lottery Platform. Ecobank, the Pan-African Bank. I just love Joy FM. Listen to the radio driving in your car. Radio gets results. Radio is there no matter where you are. Radio gets results. When you need to get your message through. Slide through this floor But I do 